there is an ongoing discussion that is happening now across the continent of these countries that Biafran flag will be raised first in Russia after the treaty has been signed. A big notation has been given and a big victory has been made. Biafran flag will be raised across four powerful countries. Four powerful countries. And after the raise of these flags across this country, a lot will be exposed in the coming future. I can be very honest with you that this man can no longer play with fire because fire is big so this discussion between the prime minister of russia and uh, the prime minister of biafra which is simon eba is yielding a bigger notation hear me and hear me clearly it is yielding a bigger notation and the voice of the people whether they like it or not must be heard that's where the whole situation begins that's just the truth that's all that's all where the whole situation begins we have come a long way and i can say it again and i'll keep saying it that my eyes are open to know who our enemies are big one who our enemies are because the more do you know what the enemies do they will want to turn you away from the truth, thereby giving you a new enemy. And that is how they have successfully turned so many of you from knowing the truth. We must stay connected. We must stay connected at all costs. Because this time around, once this flag is raised, believe you me, the discussion for Biafra referendum will follow immediately. They just said. They said just said. We have come a very, very long way. And by so doing, <laughs> I can tell you that by the grace of God, a lot and a lot and a lot will be put in place. That's just the game. That is just the game. As we continue to shoot head, and as we continue to make a big remembrance, let's understand one of the positive impacts that must be made. And once that positive impact is made, then more glorious expansion an expectation is already put in place so let's just stay connected our win is our win and our victory is our victory so what Mazi Simon Eba is doing now he's doing a very great job to make sure that nothing puts us beyond understanding nothing breaks us down because by so doing it is going to enlarge this coast and by enlarging it we will no longer need to be suffering to talk about the restoration of Biafra. That's where the whole situation room is. We are becoming more victorious. More and more victorious. Nothing less, nothing much. This is me telling you the five Possible things that is born to happen in the coming future. <laughs> yeah, we are. Oh, make one man. Hey, it has just been confirmed. Breaking Biafran Liberation Army after dealing with the zoo terrorists.
today at 4 11 2023 as they came to buy our women and children but Biafra Liberation Army neutralized many of them then took a walk to make sure our communities and towns are safe we take back our territory block my block block by block village by village town by town city by city state by state and then declaration of Biafra this is Imo state and is under total control of Biafra Army everyone is at peace so there's a report that so many zoo soldiers who came in to you know do as usual to destroy biafran land and biafran peace and of course the biafran liberation army who have been supported massively by russia italy and uh, uh, israel government were on ground to defend biafran territory you see your enemies will always feel comfortable with you when you don't do anything anytime they slap you anytime they hit you anytime they try to be bully you you don't do anything they will always be very comfortable they will like want to play so much pranks on you but simon eba has proven to everybody that block by block village by village biafrans will secure their territory we are not asking for war and we are not going to go to war but we will not sit back and watch people come into our land to destroy our land that particular thing will not happen and that is why i am urging every biafran all over the world to be at peace with whatever they wish to be at peace with so this has become a great connection a very very big connection that some of you don't even understand the whole situation if we don't fight for defense if we don't fight for defense to defend biafra land it is not going to be funny and that's just the biggest truth it is not going to be funny it's going to look in another dimension and that is where the big situation room must be connected to <laughs> hey the afro liberation force fana alolo fana alolo duegu and all ka ja to jin simon eba ojo yes you've heard them the simon eba is now a big threat you understand it's not a big threat. Ndi, ndi soldiers have all of a question in a arrow. They protect in the modified patani bundi have a question in a protect. Things are not done like that. Things are not done like that. You can't continue to destroy the people that you're supposed to be protecting. But obviously, it seems they have counted Biafrans out. Yes, that's the way it is now. Because every territory in biafra land do not have development no train station no power supply nothing nothing the, the things that so many other states are enjoying you cannot find it in biafra land makagini they then they know that we are not part of them but they just want to hold us down because of the oil in our land because of how we have hustlers how we continue to feed ourselves so when they come they jump a greater force and they will flee. They will jump a greater force and they will flee. That is why I will say it again. Anybody who is fighting Simon Eba does not understand the strategy of Piafra. Because it's not by noise making, no. it is by you doing the needful. <laughs>